Hello everybody. My name is John Gonzalez. I call this a casual chat. Uh, I'm going to be speaking out on what's wrong with the profession. We've gone through pandemic, but we our problems were long before the pandemic. Booth rental, staff turnover, trying to find quality people. Now you got new labor laws, you got inflation. Uh, it's a mess. If there's one word that describes the plight of our profession, I would say it's chaos. Business practices that you may have used in the past are outdated. So I want to share my 43 years of three of the top salons. I'm retired now or semi-retired because I promised my followers I'm going to continue building my University of Higher Learning. If you're into products and you're all showing pictures and all that, you all know how to do hair. And if you don't, there's all kinds of videos where you can get help. But this is about dealing with the challenges that we face in the beauty profession today. I just read a report where beauty schools are not considered viable career paths by the Department of Education. They're going to withdraw or cut back on student loans for beauty people entering the beauty profession. And you have to ask the question, why does this happen? I've been saying this for 10 years. We better be careful. Now these kids can't pay back student loans. Eight out of nine leave the profession. Now you've got suites. Now you can't, no, no business stability. I feel sorry for you salon owners having to go through all this nonsense. Now you're asking the Labor Department, you got to pay them minimum wage just to learn on paying customers. That doesn't make sense. When they go to beauty school, it's all about sanitation, and they get a little balance. They used to do real people as models. Now they work on doll heads. That's not the way to learn. There is so much more now. This industry has drastically changed. It's a dying industry. But yet, I believe there's all kinds of opportunities for those of you that really want to be involved in the beauty profession. It's been good to, good to me. I had to spend 43 years of trial and error. I made a lot of mistakes because most of the education required in the beauty industry is all about products. Products, products, products. Retail, retail, retail. They get us to retail their products, then they sell it at Walmart and Rite Aid. I endorse nobody. I'm going to tell it like it is. Now, some of you may not like what I've got to say. I call it tough love. But you don't see the pain that I see of my fellow work salon owners. I used to do trade shows all over the country. The, pro the challenges are always the same. How do I find good help? How do I recover from turnover? How do I get more clients? How do I? It's unbelievable. And I'm trying to find. That's why I'm building my versity, vers, version of a university of higher learning. I need your support. Now, I want to totally retire. I've been very fortunate. I learned from all my mistakes. I've written five books. I've been a lecturer at all the major trade shows. I have a lot to say. My mother was in it 50 years. My brother 50 years owning salons. I don't talk about, I'm not going to talk about hair, I'm not going to talk about products. you got all, 98% of everything you see here is all about products. They get us to sell their products and then they uh, sell it to Rite Aid or Walmart at 40% cheaper. I can go on and on. So I'm going to, I'm trying to figure out, I've written, I hope all of you go to my website. All the information is there. A lot of it is free, for God's sakes. My God, www.hcds for you, number four, you.com. Just go to my site. Look at my background. I'm not ashamed of it. I was able to retire for financial independent. I can do anything I want now. And I want to share that information so you don't have to go through what I went through. And I know many of you are struggling now. Those of you that enter, want to enter the profession, you darn right to the hell of a profession. But you're not getting the, pri the proper education. All you're seeing is the glitter and the hype. You go to hair shows, the glitter and the hype, all this avant-garde hairstyles. <laughs> what about the everyday working woman? You're totally ignoring them. 
The people that have all the money are the 45 to 65. They're loaded. And you're totally ignoring that market. If you look at the models that you see at hair shows, they're all 18, 19 year old girls that would look good in a Mohawk. So I'm going to be speaking out. I need your support. And if I don't get that support, that's fine. I retired totally, and I'm all around the world on cruises. I want to do that and spend more time with my family as well. But I owe it to those of you that followed me in the past. It's been a long, we've had a long seven years. The pandemic, now all these labor laws, now all these restrictions. Now they're going after beauty schools. Our kids don't want to go into, they make more money flipping hamburgers than a hairdressing career. You young people, this is a great profession, but you've got to take one step at a time and get the proper knowledge on personal development, how to build a clientele, how to be a marketing expert, how to promote your skills on YouTube. I can go on and on and on. And if I get enough response, I'll do my popular two-day business seminar in Las Vegas. I'll schedule it. I'm not going to talk about, if you want products and the, the, the glory, the hip, all what goes on in the industry, don't, you don't need to follow me. Don't waste your time nor mine. I want entrepreneur salon owners to have an open mind to learning. And by the way, any of you that want to call me, I'm not going to charge you coaching fees. If you got a question, give me a call. I'm here. I will talk to you. At least I can give you an opinion. If I don't have the answer, I'll show you. I'll tell you where you can get that answer. It's pretty easy. 562-592-9260. That's my phone number. And go to my website because I do. Uh, I'll give tips every Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday on business, on personal development for teachers and for students. We all have to unite together. We've got to tell it like it is. I call it tough love because I've seen all the suffering. I see it all the time. I, I, I go into your chat groups and all, it seems all you talk about is this product and that product and this, 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 this. Why don't you talk about 300 new customers in the door? Why don't you talk about how to over, overcome turnover? How do you talk about why do, how do you get a, a re, re, retention program going? An apprenticeship program, I have all that done for you. All my educational resources, everything, I have an answer to all those questions. Go to my website. Everything is guaranteed. You can at least take one book, read it. If you don't like it, give it back. So I'm really upset what's going on in the industry. You know the economy is a mess. It's uh, inflation is, is out of control. Uh, it's uncertain future for all of us. Fortunately, years ago, I was telling everyone to plan your financial security. Nobody pays attention to that. I did. My stocks are out of this world. My real estate investments are going there. I just sold one of my homes for $500,000. Come on. It's easy to make money. But you've got to get the right answer. You're not getting it in the beauty industry. All you do, 98% of everything you see is all about products. So I want to, I'm sorry if I'm a little upset because I just had an owner call me. Two of her people uh, took her to court because uh, she told them they had to uh, sell retail. And uh, then three more quit, too. Now she's got five, not to mention a lawsuit. You better know labor law. You better know labor law, you owners, because they're coming after you. So I'm, I got so much to test say. So I'm going to try to get you that information. I'm just here, and I've just been thinking about this. I said, you know, i got to say something about it. So I want to thank all of you that follow me. Please hit the like button, and let's share this with everybody. I'm putting together a Salon Owners Alliance Network. i got all kinds of projects going on for you. So I, I hope this helps you. I, I, for those of you struggling, uh, I'm going to be... Uh, using more YouTube uh, videos for you on how to overcome that. Uh, hang in there. I see a, a new beginning. Uh, business practice. Forget the past. That's gone. That's gone. So, thank you so much for your time. And you're welcome to call me. If you have a question, I'll get you an answer. If I don't have it, I'll find out for you. And I don't charge coaching fees. I don't charge you any of that stuff. 
a careful a people that want to learn. By God, I'm going to help you. Thank you, and have a good day, and enjoy life, and enjoy your family. Bye-bye.